We decided to keep things cozy this year for New Year's Eve. Yeah, cozy, but definitely festive. And we're gonna show you how this came together. Did you know there's a superstition that if you carry around an empty suitcase on New Year's Eve that you'll have lots of adventure during the coming year? Really? Well, you should be well suited because you've got plenty of vintage suitcases. <laughs> so I imagine adventure awaits. By the way, what are our plans for New Year's Eve? I think something small, intimate, maybe by the fire in the library. Okay, just the two of us? Perfect. Okay, but it needs to be sparkly and elegant. Small doesn't have to be boring. Oh wow, I can see you've already gotten started here. Yeah, oh, what you got? Well, I thought maybe we could try this for the centerpiece. I love that sequin skirt on the plain old ottoman. And the mirror, you must have taken that from upstairs off the wall. I did, it's so shiny. <laughs> well, let's get busy. I think these placemats are really intended to go like this because most tables would be straight along the edge, but for our table, I think we should turn them because we've got a curvy edge to our mirror top table. The plates yeah, the that we're plates. going to kind of use as chargers with our sweet Beautiful little, pine cones on them. I know, pine cones. I love the color scheme. It's just kind of reminiscent of the winter time, right? Kind of silvery. The brown allows us to bring in some gold too, and we have the gold edge to the ear, so. Yeah, beautiful. Really can't decide on the flatware though. The iridescent's more fun, but the lucite's really chic. Well, I'll be fun and you be chic. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these gorgeous napkins, which Felicia Murray, one of our alums at SCAD, created using gale nut and pomegranate. She hand dyed these oh. and hand embroidered them. Beautiful. Gorgeous. How about some polka dot Dorothy Thorpe glasses? Yeah, they're fantastic. <laughs> Vintage. And we need some champagne flutes too. Big champagne flutes. Yes. <laughs> These risers, mirror on mirror. You need a little bit of topography on your tabletop too. Yeah, I like that sitting at an angle too. Perfect. You know, a little tip on the candles, we put a little saran wrap on the end just to make them stay in the candlestick. We really wouldn't be without these Lucite little squares. We use them for everything. They're designer's best friend. You can pick these up on the internet and they're great to prop things up mm -hmm. to add the topography to the table. Mm -hmm and they don't add any color, so it doesn't interfere with whatever design you're creating. I always like to add a little air around any object. But we might need a little color. Let's look at these books. Neutral, red, blue, How about green. purple? Purple, perfect. A legal guide for student affairs professionals. Scintillating read. After the sun sets, this very light all over the table is gonna light the entire room, so you'll get various heights. I think some grapes would look great in here. And isn't there some kind of a tradition? I think or you're supposed to eat 12 grapes at midnight, one for each month of the year. I love these sparkly little blowers. The noise is the Chinese tradition to keep out the bad spirits. Away, so you away. blow them away, yeah. Away bad spirits. Yeah. <laughs> So SCAD has the biggest and best fibers arts department in the world. And April Rivers Lock, she made these beautiful knotted balls. Um, she's one of our SCAD fibers alums. We've commissioned her many times to make things. Yes, she does beautiful work. April's pieces bring in the beautiful textiles of the napkins and, and bring in the color mm -hmm. and the softness along with the glimmer of the silver. You don't want everything hard looking and sparkly and shiny. This adds like that very welcoming, warm touch. What about some garland? Like well, that on was you. A longer. No, I think I'm. <laughs> no, on you. <laughs> so but let's maybe, try one on the table. Yeah, let's put it on the table. <laughs> like a silvery river on this tabletop. 
Didn't Coco Chanel say, take one piece of jewelry off before you walk out the door? Maybe we toss this up for a little kind of reflection of light up on the mantle, though. What do you think? Sure. SCAD is really known for our historic preservation design. And this red oak mantle is just exquisite. Lots of little nooks and crannies, places to put your safe keepings, and also for little surprises. You've got beveled mirrors, you've got carvings, you've got also the Asian tradition of this beautiful ceramic surround to the fireplace. And I think a little Moroccan influence too in the fretwork around the fireplace. How about our seating? Let's pile these pillows around. I love the quilted, I love the fringe, I love the shimmer. The ombre is nice. Let's get one of the beaded ones over here and bring in the purple again. Okay, thank you. Oh, that's pretty. <laughs> we have a lot of pillows. Okay, okay, wait a minute. <laughs> Let's see how it feels. Who needs fireworks or Times Square when you've got a fabulous table like this? And we finished just in time to dress for dinner. Honey, what a beautiful table for our special celebration. And what an elegant way to end a very interesting year. <laughs> so true. Well, here's to new adventures. Happy, Happy New, new year. year.